Assalamu alaikum one of my subscriber ask me to make a video how to show a function a riemann integrable or integrable so in this video i show that a function f of x equal to x square is riemann integrable on closed interval 0 to b welcome to ways of mathematics channel i am amad dafis if you are new to the channel please subscribe it and make sure you click the bell icon so you get the notification of new videos let's start the video first of all note that small mk is the infimum of function f on kth interval and capital mk is equal to supremum of f on kth interval secondly lower sum is equal to summation k varies k varies from 1 to n mk delta xk upper sum is equal to summation k varies from 1 to n capital mk delta xk thirdly you see the definition of lower integral and upper integral number 4 a function f is riemann integrable or integrable if lower integral of f of dx is equal to upper integral of f of dx and it is equal to integral of a to b f of dx delta x is equal to b minus 0 over n and this is equal to b by n consider the partition p is equals to x0 is equal to 0 x1 is equals to b by n x2 is equal to 2b by n continuing this way n minus 1 b by n and the last point is n b by n which is equal to b i k is equals to kth interval k minus 1 b by n up to k b by n the value of mk is equal to k b by n whole square which is equals to k square b square divided by n square mk is equal to k minus 1 b by n whole square this is equal to k minus 1 whole square b square by n square the value of upper sum is the putting of the value of mk k square b square over n square into the value of delta xk is b by n this is equal to b cube by n cube summation summation k varies from 1 to n k square this is equal to b cube by n cube into n plus n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 by 6 you get n plus 1 Two n plus one, six n square, b cube. The value of lower sum is summation k varies from one to n. K minus one whole square, b square, over n square into b by n. This is equal to b cube n cube summation k varies from one to n k minus one whole square b cube over n cube n minus one into n to n minus one divided by six to n minus one 2n minus 
divided by 6 n square b cube. The value of lower integral is equals to limit n approaches to infinity. n minus 1, 2n minus 1, b cube divided by 6n square equals to b cube by 6 limit n approaches to infinity n square 1 minus 1 over n into 2 minus 1 over n divided by n square n square is cancelled with n square and applying the limit you get b cube by 6 similarly for upper integral we get b cube by 6 lower integral 0 to b f of x dx is equals to upper integral from 0 to b f of x dx and this is equal to b cube by 3 therefore f is Riemann integral from 0 to 0 to b and the value of integral a to b f of x dx is equal to b cube by 3.